50 years as a state today, but Hawaii was evolving years before 1959 thanks to leaders with vision. Ron Mizutani takes a closer look at one of those leaders, Henry J. Kaiser, who ironically came to Hawaii to retire. Henry J. Kaiser was a man with incredible vision. He was an American industrialist, the father of modern American shipbuilding, and a leader in industrial medicine and public health. After his many accomplishments, Kaiser moved to Hawaii. You know, his son sent him here to retire. They thought they could, you know, get rid of the old guy, but he wasn't ready to retire. Not by a long shot. Kaiser's vision for the future, including developing swampland near the ocean. Another interesting thing is that Magic Island didn't exist in 1959. Henry Kaiser first proposed it in 1955, and he wanted to build two real big islands between Koala Basin and what is now the peninsula of Magic Island, and he offered to pay for the whole thing if the city let him put six hotels on the property. <laughs> six hotels with two islands built on the reef with bridges connecting them. The city walked at the idea, but allowed the development of what we call Magic Island. Island today. But Kaiser was not done with development ideas. So he built the Hilton Hawaiian Village, developed uh, Hawaii Kai, uh, named it too. It was, uh, one of his names that he considered was Hawaii Kaiser. He settled with Hawaii Kai instead. Today, there are many other reminders of his legacy, including Kaiser Permanente and Kaiser High School. So he really wasn't ready for retirement. The man who came to Hawaii to relax in paradise did anything but relax. And many are glad he didn't. Rodney Zatani, KHON 2 News.